All right, we're out here hunting. Taking a few photo shots too. Pretty quiet this morning, but uh, thought I'd give you a view of where we're out here hunting at. Let's take a look. This is where we're hunting today. We're gonna set up our little spot here. Problem is, is uh, it's been raining a lot. Everything is sopping wet. Much nicer. Kick some weeds down in front of me. Oh. Okay, kill it. Should have been a duck pod. I don't it's know. It's cold. That's a, that's a whole lot better than laying on the wet, though, isn't it? It's so much better than laying on the wet. And you know <laughs> the best thing is? I can just wipe this down with a cloth. I don't have to launder it. No, I know. So much nicer, except yeah. for the tree stump that's poking me. I never was a fan of those until I bought this one. Been using it. This is nice. It's Keeps a lot my better. Gun dry. Keeps everything nice and dry. Yeah. Plenty of room for the full body and your gun. I like the knees where you can have yeah. the extra support in the knees. Yeah. Right. So, but it does make it a lot nicer to move around. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Yeah. And you know, even though it's wet out here, you know, I'm not getting wet, so. All right. Well, there's not much moving here, so I guess we'll go ahead and pack up and head down the road, see if we can find a better place. Okay. Yeah, this is the midway version here. Got nice little areas for your knees, elbows and everything. And then that flap that flips out, pretty nice. All right, we're back where it's a little warmer, a little drier, but uh, the reason for this video is actually to talk about the shooting mats. And um, I was never a big fan of shooting mats just because I always wanted to shoot in more of a real world condition, laying in the mud and the rocks and stuff like that, but uh, maybe it's just my age getting to me. I bought one, been using this for a little while now, and um, I'm pretty sold on these. Uh, it's just a lot nicer when you're climbing in and out of your rig. You're not just full of mud and stuff, so I don't have to clean my truck as much. Um, they're just nicer, and they're convenient. They're super fast to just roll them out, roll them up. Nice and compact. Little carry handle here. They come with a sling. They're super lightweight, and they're big enough for your full body plus your firearm. And one thing I've noticed is they're not just good when you're out shooting in the rain. They're actually really good when you're shooting in dusty conditions because it doesn't allow that, especially if you have a muzzle brake, it doesn't kick everything up in front of you. You wind up with sand in your eyes and a bunch of dust. So these are pretty slick. This one here is a Midway brand. Um, now I'm going to leave an affiliate link down below um, because, well, it helps support the channel. It doesn't cost you anything extra, so why not do it? Um, so if you're in the market for one of these, um, check out that link. But these are pretty slick. They just... Uh, Velcro, they're super easy to clean too, very easy to clean. But <clears throat> nice extra padded area here for your knees and also 
up here for your elbows and stuff, just a little bit of extra uh, covering on there. And this little flap that folds out, this just kind of comes out in front of uh, right, basically right where your muzzle goes. So keeps things from kicking up. Uh, also, if you're laying in a grassy area, it helps kind of push that grass down in front of you. So I don't know, they're pretty slick. So I've changed my tune on shooting mats. They're, uh, they're just pretty nice. Um, I know a lot of you folks out there already use them. I also know a lot of folks don't. So if you're interested, uh, I'm pretty sold on this uh, on this Midway one. So, and I know there's a lot of them out there. Uh, this one here, I think, was about 40 bucks, 39 or 40 bucks. So that's not bad. They have cheaper ones. I've seen some cheaper ones. I don't know if I'd go too cheap with these, but uh, I've also seen them out there where they're just super expensive. So anyways, I wanted to keep this video short. We had a good time hunting. We didn't kill anything. It was pretty nasty out there, but you know, we got out there at daybreak and buzzed around. So, um, you know, there was actually a lot of other hunters out there. So uh, things were kind of getting pushed around, probably hiding off in the timber somewhere. So uh, we had some other plans today, so we had to come back, got a lot of work to do. Um, <clears throat> working on the DVD series too for the uh, the Remage and the Savage build, so slowly stitching that all together, and um, it probably take me a couple months, but uh, but uh, anyways, uh, hey, thanks for watching again, and we'll be back real soon with some more stuff. Take it easy.